perhaps like he was intellectually sparring with you and he was being aggressive about it? I think he felt I think he felt that. I think he felt that it was necessary to challenge me, that that was his role as a journalist. But fundamentally, he was smug. He thought he came at the entire conversation with an air of intellectual condescension. It was built right into the discussion right from the beginning, and he never dropped it at all. It's like, well, I know what you're doing, and I know what's up, and I know how to take you apart, and I know that whatever you're talking about is just an attempt to defend your how actually reprehensible you opinions. For? Oh, God, about an hour, something like that. And how much did they use? Oh, in the clips, hardly any of it. I don't even know, a couple of minutes. So, yeah. Yeah, so your tendency to get riled up can be exploited. Yes, of course. And yeah. it's, 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 it's the problem of deviating from the doctrine of minimal necessary force. Like, the best times, the best interactions I've had with contentious journalists is where I've absolutely kept my cool, you know. 